Hey, this is Mike with 5-Minute Guide. This video is going to take a quick look at some of the gestures now available in iOS 7. So one of the first things that you may have noticed if you're an avid Spotlight user is that Spotlight doesn't seem to be there anymore. It used to be that you could swipe to the left and pull up a nice little search bar to search your contacts, search your email, search anything on your phone, or search the web or Wikipedia. Um, because somehow Wikipedia is different than the web, I don't, I don't know what that's all about. There's good news and there's bad news about this. The good news is that you can actually access Spotlight from any home screen now. You just simply put your finger in the middle of the screen and pull downward. Um, you'll pull up a search bar. The bad news is that this only searches items on your phone. There's no more searching the web uh, with this feature. So it's all anything that's stored on your phone. Emails, music, contacts, anything like that. So there's gesture number one. Gesture number two, which is probably my new favorite gesture, is to pull your finger up from the bottom of the screen. This brings up a control center. From the control center, you can toggle all sorts of network settings like airplane mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, or my favorite, do not disturb. Um, you can quickly change your brightness, which is fantastic for me. I'm a pizza delivery driver, and uh, as the night goes on, I'm constantly lowering my brightness on my screen. Um, you can get into your music. Uh, if you have an iPhone 5 or higher, you can do AirDrop, which is a fantastic way to share files over Wi-Fi with people who are in your vicinity. Um, and then you've even got a built-in flashlight, your alarm clock, calculator, and camera. So this is a great way to access these things much more quickly than you used to be able to. Um, now finally, if you pull down from the top, just like you used to do for the notification center, you'll have a new notification center that has three different sections to it, today, all, and missed. Uh, you, can, you can actually remove the today section if you'd like. You can totally rearrange this in the settings, uh, which we'll cover in another video. But those are some great new gestures that you can use to navigate your phone and, uh, and get things done more efficiently. Well, as always, if you've got any questions or anything else that you'd like to say, leave me a comment, and uh, please subscribe to the channel and share with your friends. Thanks. Catch you next time.